Okay. Uh, we will continue on the uh, unit of marketing. Specifically, what we're going to look at today is to understand what industrial market is and also what consumer market is. Now, let's start off with industrial market. So, industrial market refers to a producer market as well, simply because it consists of individuals and firms who purchase goods and services to, with the intention of making a profit, with the intention of adding more value to it so that they can make money out of it. For example, it could be a manufacturer that produces um, wonderful tasty biscuits, right? And it's all packed in beautiful packages and it's being sold to all the supermarkets around, right? And what those supermarkets do, of course, is to resell those products uh, those or the biscuits for a profit. So that's an example of an industrial market. Then they also, then we also look at consumer market. Consumer market uh, it refers to people who buy these products and services for their own use. They buy them from the industrial market for their own use and not for profit. This refers to the people like you and I who do who does this, right? Now there are ways and uh, or, or the different ways that is involved in terms of um, communicating or marketing products of industrial market, and it's usually in the form of direct communication to the individual businesses, or you know in terms of pamphlets and business magazines where businesses are able to find out how to buy you know items from these industrial markets such as you know. The biscuits that we're talking about right so you have a direct communication or in terms of reaching out to these industrial markets as well as pamphlets magazines and whatnot yeah however in terms of consumer market people like you and i how are we attracted to buying goods and services for ourselves this is where businesses will use items or uh, above the line messaging in terms of uh, tv advertisements or even uh, sometimes in terms of a promotion in mass media all right. Uh, these are also used to convince us to buy these products and services. Yeah. So basically, in short, there are two types of markets, you know, industrial market and consumer market. And the way it is, uh, the way the communication takes place to market these products, right, it differs whether or not it is an industrial or a consumer market. Now, we've come to the end of today's very short lesson, Industrial and Consumer Market. Um, as usual, if you like this video, please do share it around with your friends and please subscribe. All right. Thank you for watching.